Hello everyone, so I got these uh, Turkish sauces just recently, actually a couple days ago. Uh, they are of the Luke family. I got this uh, Kisa Sop Baglama, which is a um, sort of the mid-range mid kind of instrument. Uh, this is the short-necked Baglama saws. And this is a Kura saws, which is kind of like the mandolin of the family. Uh, they're both of the lute family. They've got these, these tied frets made of nylon and they're set up in a they go all the way around They're set up in a uh, You've got your Western uh, 12 tone frets here, but then you've got these little quarter tone frets Which give it its kind of unique sound. This has six strings and this one has seven <laughs> So the Kurosage has a slightly higher tuning and uh, it's, as I said, it's kind of like the mandolin of the family. Another neat thing is when you uh, go off, you can go off the fretboard right onto the soundboard. There's actually not much of a fretboard, it's flush uh, with the soundboard, so you can go. So another quirk, if, in case you haven't noticed, is that the sound hole is on the bottom. So this greatly deviates from what's in most Western instruments, which is uh, sound holes that point towards the audience. Um, so this has a sound hole on the bottom. Some higher end uh, sauces also have a second sound hole with a rotating cover. So it's kind of like a, it's kind of like a, you know, it's like kind of like studio monitors, but it's acoustic with the uh, instrument. And same with uh, this one. If you notice, there's a strip at the bottom. This is structural. It's to hold this thing because these uh, bowl backs are made of many strips of wood. As you can see, this is um, looks to be maple and ebony, and this bowl back is made of mahogany. I'm not sure what the uh, necks are made of. They're either made of maple, beech, or horn beam. I couldn't really find a lot of info on this. This might be horn beam by the look of it. Um, anyways, uh, I'm r I really look forward to using this in some of my songs. Uh, I hope you like this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and don't forget to hit that bell. Uh, a lot of people haven't been getting notifications because you know, YouTube tends to suppress it unless you click all. So if you want to see all my notifications, you can click that bell. If not, that's fine. And as always, thanks for watching.